If you would like to request a video, send an email to questions at newstitchaday.com. How to knit, beginning a row with a yarn over. For this tutorial, you will need a pair of knitting needles and a ball of yarn. Special thanks to our sponsor Lion Brand for providing today's yarn. Today we are using their Woolies Thick and Quick line in the color Citron. Sometimes when you're knitting you'll come across a pattern that asks you to start your row with a yarn over and this can be kind of confusing especially for new knitters what that actually looks like. So I think the best way to explain this is by showing you or talking a little bit about what a yarn over is. And Basically, when you're yarning over, you're, you're moving the yarn from where it normally should be. So if you're knitting, it will be behind. If you're purling, it will be in front to the opposite side. Sometimes they'll say to yarn around the needle uh, or they'll say to yarn forward. Um, and those often are used for yarn overs as well. So when you're yarning over to begin a row, what we want is the yarn to be creating an extra stitch before we start the row, and that's usually because of a lace pattern. So f to begin the row with the yarn over, what we're going to do is bring the yarn in front of the needle. So here we're supposed to be knitting, and the yarn should be in back. And so we're going to bring the yarn this direction. And then we will pull the yarn back over the needle where it should be for the knit stitch. So I'm going to knit into this next stitch. And you can see by working the stitch as normal, the needle gets in the way and then creates an additional stitch. And what you would use this in conjunction with usually is a knit two together which is going to create a little eyelet hole like this one here. So just to review, to yarn, to begin the row with the yarn over, we want the yarn to be in front of the needle before we start. Now if we were purling, we would have the yarn behind the needle and then we would bring it in front. So we would place the needle in front of the yarn, insert our stitch purlwise, and then knit like normal. Okay, and now we end up with two stitches on our needle. So, that's how we begin a row with the yarn over. Want more New Stitch a Day? Check out our website at newstitchaday.com. New Stitch a Day is a craftery media production. Check out our other shows at fiberstory.tv and yarntripper.com. This video is licensed under a Creative Commons Attribution No Derivatives 3.0 Unported License, which means use it on your website, put it in your patterns, but please don't change anything.